drug addicts have a problem with peace, mate. Like, like you don't, I were not taught to treasure peace. I thought peace was boredom. I only know high adrenalized states like that. I'm either adrenalized or I'm unconscious. My addiction reached its perhaps most obvious culmination in heroin addiction and heroin addiction feels like it shuts you down. All of the doubt, all of the loathing, all of the discomfort of having skin, of having a body, of the abrasiveness of this world, of the abrasiveness of inner and outer judgment. Heroin's like, zzz, just shuts it down into a mm. sort of a bliss. It's like it takes away all of the raw nerve endings. And then after that, it's sort of like, I find peace. I never knew how to recognize it. I've got, I, like, you know, before we were recording, I talked about I'm overstimulated. There's a lot of stuff going on. I'm a senator, I'm a senator's wife. Oh, yeah. wow, what's going on? Who are all these people? Mm. So extraordinary. And I, I've, I'm only just learning, as you have articulated, Shauna, to recognize the beauty of peace, that peace is what's on offer, not peace with my external circumstances, which may remain turbulent, but that inwardly I can find a piece that passeth all understanding. And I'm trying to return to it whenever I can, because I've always been qu quite well acquainted with anxiety, and anxiety is just fear in three mm -hmm. syllables, isn't it?